notifications bar up the top here and it displays reminders and status icons of what's on the phone and if you flick down then it's got more detail of those particular notifications. Then the second part here is the display screen and then the third third part is down the bottom here where we've got the touch sensitive buttons here like this one is the telephone so if you touch that naturally it brings up the dialer uh, if you touch the launcher here it launches into the applications and if you touch the internet there um, it's not connected at the moment but that would launch you into the internet then on the right here there are two dots and also on the left hand side there are two dots and they're what they call interface switching dots and what it means is that there's two more screens to the right and then there's no more to the right but now there's four dots on the left which means that there are four screens to, to the left. Next thing to consider is locking your screen and to do that it's very simple you just simply press the main power button and that locks the screen. To unlock it we just press it a second time and it turns, it turns itself back on. Now another way that to lock your screen is simply to let it stand idle and you'll find that your phone turns off just like that and even though it's locked you can still receive phone calls and messages. The other way to uh, turn it back on is to push the select button that turns it back on.